it's Jackie and today I want to tell you about a project I'm working on because I thought maybe you'd want to work on it too. I know we're all subscribing to the same YouTube channels like um, there's a lot of main channels we all subscribe to but I think there's a few that maybe I subscribe to and you don't or you subscribe to that I don't so I just want to make sure everybody knows that this is going on. Over on YouTube user Cat Hands channel she's doing a series called Mixed Media Morsels and I'm having so much fun with it um, that I wanted to recommend it to you. What she's doing is putting on a series of tiny um, lessons in a tiny book and you just kind of follow along. She's been releasing about once a week. There's three lessons up or four lessons up already. Uh, I've completed three of them. So um, basically all you need to get started is just the tiniest little notebook you can find and I wish I could show you how small it is. So I thought the best comparison I could show you is here it is next to a quarter. Here it is next to my Fobonichi. It's just like a tiny little, I don't know, four inch book. It's like the size of a three by four card. Um, and she said just get a composition book at the um, dollar store. I got a little Rhodia graph book at Desairs. It was $1.50. She does a tutorial on how you can decorate it using jelly printed labels. I didn't have any jelly printed labels. So I used my masking stickers washi tape um, and I just covered, I just painted it with black acrylic paint and then I set down the uh, washi tape and then I just covered it with MAC medium, did my titles with some Mambi letters and I just closed it with this little Tim Holtz clip. Super cute and it's so small and fun. And um, inside I just have this masked off. I'll take that off when the book is done. The first thing she showed us how to do was this shiny plastic wrap. Um, it's like shiny and it's textured. Plastic wrap background. And I follow her lessons exactly. That's how I learn is by emulating a lot of people who are doing things a lot more creative than what I'm doing. I'm just copying what she does. Then the next day was collage day and you do your initial on it and like a little tissue paper stick it down thing, nice and shiny. And then we did alcohol, um, like rubbing alcohol and it like dispersed the ink so the yellow was underneath and it shows through. You cover it with blue and then the alcohol ink the uh, rubbing alcohol disperses it and that's as far as I am in my book so far. Next up it's going to be uh, a glue resist background. I'm going to work on that one today but I just wanted to show you because if you've ever thought like I want to do mixed media and I don't know where to start, she's doing free lessons and it's a great place to start. You're going to end up with this small little adorable wonderful reference book when you're done and um, I'm just having so much fun with it. So um, definitely check out her channel. I'll link to it below and um, yeah, I hope that you uh, have as much fun with this as I do. Thanks for watching.